for Boston. Smart in the backcourt with Brown to his side. Jason Tatum is out there with Horford, and it's Williams at the center position. And for the Warriors, at the guard spots, it's Curry and Thompson. Here we go. Raymond Green is out there with Peyton, and it's Wiggins in at the three spot. Smart against Curry, and it's Williams Love throwing it, it down. Oh, nice look there from Smart, finding the open man. Curry finds Green. Good, and Curry gets the assist. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. And here's Boston. Outside Williams. Tatum wide open. He fires one. Wide open shot is on the money. The natural leader and active scorer. I mean, when Tatum is firing off the catch, you know he's Pass to Wiggins. Back to Curry. The three ball. The shot. No good. Outside Tatum. Fires from deep. The second chance effort. The Celtics keep it going. A new 14-second shot clock. Six to shoot. It's another look. And too long on the shot. We talk so much about Tatum's influence, Chris, at the offensive end. But he's become an impact defender as well. Instincts, limp. You see he's got added muscle. I mean, Kevin, uh, that's what the best players do at this position. Think about it. LeBron, Kawhi, KD. All lockdown defenders when they put their minds to it. Now, here's Curry. Following the miss by Draymond Green. Now, Brown. The pass to Williams. Brown outside. And it's good off the back of the rim and in. Oh, just a smooth looking jump shot. Brown looking totally comfortable firing from out there. Green pitch to Wiggins. Out to Thompson. It's stolen by Brown. Smart wide open. He fires. The shot's good. Brown making the play. Give Smart so much credit. I mean, he's worked hard on his three-point shot. It's improved so much since he's entered the league. Peyton attacking and stolen by Horford. And up the court come the Celtics on the break. Here's Smart. And it comes off the front of the rim. And it's Thompson with the ball. He'll bring it up for San Francisco. They trail by six. And stolen by Tatum. Outside, smart. Here's Horford, and the dunk by Horford. Oh, look at the big fella Al get up. Given his size, dunking is basically second nature. Peyton kicks to Curry. And here in the first, uh, about three minutes here. And there's the call on Curry. That is his first foul of the game. And really just a great play to sacrifice his body and take the charge. And some changes here for the Warriors. Michael Jordan, he's checked in for Wiggins. James Harden comes in for Klay Thompson. And it's Russell Westbrook in for Curry. And Draymond Green picks up the foul. That's his first foul. That's his first foul. First team foul. Here's Pritchard. To the wing on the left. Neesmith. And the three ball is good. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. And it's Harden with the ball for the Warriors. 11-point game. Payton finds Westbrook. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. Payton passes to Westbrook. Trying to end the drought. That's good. And it's Payton with the assist. Oh, man. This was first great Westbrook makes the three look so nice. Here's White. That shot, no good. And it's the Warriors taking it the other way. Tice against Green. No one near Peyton as he lets it go. And they get it. San Francisco with a three. Uh, when you have a four man with this kind of vision and the unselfishness to go with it, Unreal advance. Draymond Green getting it done. 
Now here's White. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. The finish was nice, but the setup was better. Yeah, G.A., the pick working to full effect before the stop. Your yeah, coach is definitely pleased. That's the execution he loves to see. Really well done there. Just confident and composed, never in a hurry. Get the teardrop, and it's good on the way in. This is as good as it gets for a first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. Here's Harden for three, Westbrook. Back to Peyton. Crafty move. He lays it in. Peyton's got five. If you let Russ operate in the pick and roll, I mean, he's going to make great decisions. And here's White. Pass to Tice. Williams for three. A free flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. Austin on top, leading by five. And we'll get things started in the second quarter when we return. Just tuning in, the second quarter of action is where we're at right now. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Celtics. Well, they're just a team to see right now. Their passion in the first half has been outstanding. And also, they're jumping on a lot of turnovers, making sure they turn them into points at the other end. On the court for the Celtics. Outside, the wings are Brown and Tatum. Then there's Horford. Then it's Marcus Smart. And it's Cornette in at the five down low. Tatum. Raymond Green grabs the miss. And so it's San Francisco with it, trailing by two. Curry outside. Doesn't go for it. Now the Celtics take it the other way. They've led by as many as 11 points. Here's Smart. Trills the three-pointer. Smart. Smart's got his Three second points. best. And, and that's how you build confidence in your shot. Smart able to set his feet off the catch and shoot. It's Thompson off the drive. Murray finds Wiggins. There's the three. And Peyton gets it to go on the assist by Wiggins. Eight points for him. Going to be with very little pressure on their perimeter shooters. Three of the last five baskets they've allowed have been from beyond. Murray brings the double. Brown outside. And stolen by Wiggins. And they're pushing it up. There's Green with the three. San Francisco passing it around. And pushing it up. Here's Boston. Smart leading the charge. Tatum against Wiggins. Outside, Green. Kicks to Thompson. Curry against Smart. Curry passes to Green. Shoots over Brown. Clock at four. And it's out of bounds. And they say it was last touch by Brown. Great instincts from him to get a hand on that pass and tip it out. But just trying to prevent the opposition from getting comfortable. Next time, that one might get picked. Pools checked in for the Warriors. And the Celtics also making a change. Robert Williams is checked in for Luke Cornett. And here's Smart after the three-pointer from Stephen Curry. That's a big boy bucket by Horford. He just used his delicate touch despite getting bodied by the dude. The Celtics shooting their first foul shot of the game. Horford, one shot. Curry deciding where to go with it. Wiggins dishes to Curry. But Trey... That balls. Nice feed that time from Wiggins. Curry's got the lead up to one now for San Francisco. Smart passes to Williams. And here's Brown outside. Buries the long-range jumper. Brown's got five points so far. Now, this is the fire you love seeing. Now, Brown doesn't back down from anyone. He relishes getting his revenge. Wiggins kicks to Curry. Green with a screen on Smart to the paint and stolen by Horford. Covered by Wiggins. Two free throws coming up and they call the shooting foul. 
against Stephen Curry. Yeah, way to play in attack mode and get to the line. For Boston, they have made the only other free throw attempt today in an earlier trip to the line. And some changes here for San Francisco. Michael Jordan is checked in for Wiggins. James Harden comes in for Poole. And it's Russell Westbrook in for Stephen Curry. And then for Boston, Williams is checked in for Horford. Neesmith comes in for Jalen Brown. And it's Pritchard in for Marcus Smart. Harden finds Westbrook. Six on the shot clock. Williams with the steal. Celtics leading by four. Here's Pritchard. Takes it off the glass. Really crisp, intelligent passing to make that basket possible. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. Shot to stop the run. Rebound, Boston. Floats it up for Williams. And Williams with the stuff. What I really love about this kid, you know, Williams is, a, he's physical, he's explosive, and yes, he plays above the rim. He, he just brings that nastiness to the game. Green left side. Harden dishes to Westbrook. Down to five on the shot clock. Double team on West From deep green. And stolen by Williams. 46 seconds left in the second quarter. Neesmith, the pass to Pritchard. He gets that one. And it's a 10-point Boston lead. That's their third straight make off an assist. Passes it to Green. The kick out to Westbrook. Now here's Peyton. Back to Westbrook. Launches a three. Peyton against Williams. That's his fourth basket of the game. And he's only taken four shots off to a good start. Here's Pritchard. Got a piece of it. And stolen by Jordan. Peyton dishes to Westbrook. That's in, coming off an assist from Peyton. Now, just a five-point Boston lead. Oh, what outstanding initiative from Westbrook. He has the such a good feel for what he's scoring And a close game so far through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Celtics lead by five. We'll see you after halftime for the beginning of the third quarter. After a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. So with Harden on the bench, here's the group that Steve Kerr has on the floor. At the guard spot, it's Curry and Thompson. Peyton is out there with Green, and it's Wiggins in at the three. Now Tatum, following the miss by Draymond Green from deep. Williams looking around. Round with it, now Peyton defending. Down kicks to Horford. Four on the shot clock. For the three. And the ball out of play. The Warriors will inbound. And for everything he provides on offense, Chris, Brown's defense is just as impactful. Kevin Strong, tough, quick twitch athleticism. He plays with tremendous power. He's found his rhythm from deep, and you can see the confidence. The basket looks as big as the ocean right now. I mean, that's how easy he's making it look. The real. Come at us, and we're coming right back at you. Let's talk about the great competition going on. That's what makes a matchup like this so much fun to watch. Now, here's Green. Here's Peyton. Trying to come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. Brown against Wiggins. Brown drives in. And he drops in the layup off the glass. 
Now it's a seven-point Celtic lead. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. On the wing, Wiggins. And that's out of bounds. San Francisco will retain possession. Daniel Tice is checked in for Robert Williams. Daniel Tice. Just over a minute and a half played here in the third. On its way from Curry for two. San Francisco again missing. Celtics leading by seven. Smart kicks to Tice. And no good that time. Great tee that time from Green. Thompson passes to Wiggins. Right side Curry. On the wing, Wiggins. Guarded by Tatum. Five to shoot. Here's Curry. And it's sent back by Horford. Oh, you can't be careless around Horford. Throw up a weak shot around him, he'll send it back. Smart against Curry. Smart dishes to Brown. The kick out to Tatum. The Celtics get it back in a new 14. And the refs are going to rule that unnecessary contact. It's a flagrant one foul. Boy, a, a very hard foul that time. And the officials had to slap him with the flagrant. I mean, you can't let him get away with that kind of contact. Yeah, gee, that's an easy call for the officials to make when there's that much contact. The league is really cracking down on those sort of plays. Oh, he's such a good free throw shooter. I mean, it frees him up to be as aggressive as he wants in the post. Pools checked in for Curry. The Celtics also changing it up. Thomas checked in for Brown. And it's wide in for Marcus Smart. Another rebound hauled in. They're hitting the glass with a lot of cash. You can't hit that one. The teammates are going to think twice about feeding you next time. Here's Wiggins. At the elbow, Green. Pass to Poole. Two minutes remaining in the third. To stop Two. the price. A routine foul. Foul it's his first trip to the line. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your home team, Jordan. Poole. No good on the free throw. Probably, probably, probably a little draft shots. in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that. Absolutely. Mark. Catching up on the changes for San Francisco. Michael Jordan, he's checked in for Andrew Wiggins. And it's Russell Westbrook in for Clay Thompson. Then for the Celtics, Luke Cornett is checked in for Daniel Thomas. Williams comes in for Al Horford. And it's Neesmith in for Tatum. The Warriors shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. First one falls for him. Jordan. Two shots. All free throws good from Poole. And there's a minute 45 left in the third. White with it. Westbrook picks him up. And the pass to Neesmith. To the middle. And stolen by Jordan. Here's Westbrook. Here's Peyton. That's another one for him. His fifth in just seven shots. Yeah, with Westbrook on the ball, you can't have a hole in your defense. He's too smart to miss. Williams. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Celtics have been good at the line so far. Five of five. First free throw is good. Celtics making a switch here. Grant Williams. Two shots. And both free throws good for Williams. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line this half. Westbrook kicks to Green. And three from Jordan. Good as Green picking up the assist. Green's got three assists now in this one. Yeah, nice timing there on that catch and shoot. Jordan with such a musical rhythm to his game. Now here's White. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Pass to Pritchard. Over Jordan. Again, the miss by the Celtics. San Francisco trails by four. He dishes it to Westbrook. And there are the Warriors now with another bucket. Oh, very effective. Once he gets this close, I mean, Westbrook knows he has what it takes to capitalize. 
Chris Pritchard. This one for three. Boston again missing. Green in the post. Passes it to Poole. And here is Peyton. The kick out to Westbrook. And again, it's San Francisco with the three. Seven lead changes now, and we're just in the third quarter. Yeah, frustrating for a coach, but it's great to watch as a fan. That concludes the third quarter. It continues to be an exciting neck-and-neck -neck game. The Warriors on top, leading by just one. And after a quick break, we're going to come right back with the start of the fourth quarter. Now let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. And how about the big fella here showing us he's got some point guard skill here with the tremendous setup. This is where the NBA is headed. I mean, multi-dimensional big man. And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. On the floor for Boston. Smart in the backcourt with Brown to his side. Horford is out there with Jason Tatum. And it's Williams at the five. Now here's Curry. And he drives in. A three-pointer. Wiggins rebounded by the Celtics. Brown finds Smart. Back to Brown. Fires the three. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Harden. Team basketball. Here's Brown, and the dunk by Brown. Uh, the near seven-foot wingspan of Jalen Brown. I mean, the hops. Uh, this is a guy who can dunk anywhere. good. It's been this way since halftime. Tremendous production from beyond the arc. Yeah, they aren't just chucking up anything. I mean, they're doing a great job of creating quality looks. Now, here's Brown. Warford sets a screen for Brown. Makes the bucket. Now he's got five field goals. Five for eight in the game. And all quarter long, he's been zeroed in and, and knocks down big shot after big shot here in the fourth. Wasted no time on that one. Their third three-pointer in a row. Boston trails by three. About a minute and a half into the fourth quarter now. Here's Horford. Good, and Smart gets the assist. It's been like this all night for both teams. The offenses having their way. Yeah, but defensively, neither side has been able to adjust. And that's reflected in the score. Now here's Wiggins. Knocks it loose. Now the fast break. Tatum with the ball. Here's Smart. Uses the glass to finish the way. And that's now 11 points for Marcus Smart. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Celtics. They play the heads-up brand of basketball this entire game, and they've got the steals to prove it. And the other thing they've done since the beginning of this game is score points off turnovers and in bunches. Not shy from outside. There, there's no doubt about that. Spreading the floor and hitting them up. Kicks it out to Wiggins. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. That's a dozen straight points coming off the trip. Outside Tatum. San Francisco making a switch here. Thompson's checked in. First team foul. Coming onto the floor for your home team. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Second chance shot. And the layup good by Brown. Brown's got six in the quarter. So Brown's coach once told him, you have to want the rebound. He certainly stepped up his efforts on the glass over the years. Now, here's Green. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. In the corner, it's Wiggins. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. Wiggins has got a pair of threes here in the fourth quarter for San Francisco. We've got 155 left in the fourth quarter. Hit him against Wiggins. 13 feet away. There's Williams. Wiggins with the block. Staying engaged defensively. Wiggins has all the tools to be a 
great defender. Oh, and it's out of bounds. The Celtics will take it the other way. And what a time to get sloppy. A close game like this, you cannot be getting loose with the ball. I'm glad we got to see the mobile one block once more. What a play. Yeah, quick thinking pays off big. What a block. And here's Boston. Outside Tatum. Again, the miss by the Celtics. And so Green will bring it up for the Warriors. Driving inside. Williams with the block. A main staple in Williams' game. That sixth sense for when to rise up and deter those shots. Brown's gone just one of four from deep. Here's Sigma. Knocks down the three ball. Sigma's got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Tatum deciding where to go with it. Here's Horford. Here's Williams. Plenty of drama in this one so far. Yeah, don't be surprised if it isn't decided until the final buzzer. Now a timeout called by Boston. They're behind by three. 50 seconds left in the fourth. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Alder. Thank you, Kevin. During the last break, got to listen in on Ime Adoka's huddle with his team. With this game in the balance, he really came after his guys. He said, this is our time. Right now, be in the moment with each other. Do your job, and I promise you, we'll win this game. Back to you. Thank you, David. And the Celtics with possession here. Trailing by five. Will it go? And misses it off the right side of the rim. It's almost like he's trying to make things hard on himself. You know, he's just got to slow the game down. And try to get some easy ones. A bucket here would give them a bit more room. True, but, but no need to rush it. Play smart. Late the game. Up big. They continue to attack. About running up the score. It's about closing the door on any kind of comeback. I think it's safe to call this one a wrap. But yeah, the game got away from them. But hopefully, they've learned some things and hopefully, they'll be able to make some adjustments next time. On the wing, Thompson. Curry passes to Thompson. Back to Curry. Shoots the three, off target. And so it's San Francisco winning this one. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. Yeah, I mean, it was a solid performance, uh, particularly here at home. Uh, I think they built off that edge of being here and they play with just a little more confidence than their opponent. And that about wraps it up for Greg Anthony, Chris Weber, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports.